Hey guys, we're back and today we are going to um, compare our boxy boxes um, with each other, like to see who got what kind of stuff. Stephanie gets a lot of boxes, but I only get the smaller one. I don't know what it's called. Just a regular box. Just a regular box, but she gets like all these crazy ones. But we're going to compare our smaller box. She gets this one, I get it, so we're gonna just going to compare and see what we got. You go first. Okay, so I got the variation 66, and Jessica got what? 23. 23. So, first thing on my box is the most expensive thing. I don't know. It's called the 111 skin, or 111, I don't know how you say it. It's like a pollution defense booster, so this retails at $135. So, me and Jess just did the calculation, and her box was like, a hundred, a little bit. A hundred dollars, like less, almost a little less than a hundred dollars. Hers was like a total of one twenty-five, and mine was like two thirty-two. Yeah. But anyways, it's this little serum. So basically, what this serum does is it boosts to fortify your skin against harmful aggressors of the digital age. So I'm assuming it's like for the blue light pollution. Which I'm always on my phone, so maybe this little sucker is going to come in handy. But it's $135. I don't know if I'm going to use it. Um, I got Clean Skin Club Vitamin C Brightening Booster. It looks like this. I opened the box, but um, it retails for $49.95, so nothing compared to like the price of Steph's. Um, and then the inside looks like this. And it, it's like a nice Is bottle. this the one that smells good? Oh, no. Yeah, it smells good. It smells like pineapple, watermelon, and green tea. Brightens the complexion for glowing skin, protects against UV damage, and helps reduce signs of aging. And it smells, it smells delicious. But I don't know if I would even use it. I don't even do face stuff. But you should start. But I should, face but stuff. I don't. But I don't know. Maybe I'll keep it. Maybe I'll use it. I don't even know how you use it, but I guess I'd read the directions. You just put serum on your face. Oh, like, it makes three drops. Like so after your you take serum. a shower. And before you, you go to bed, just put it in. Oh, okay. Maybe I will use it. I need to. I don't use any face stuff. Because once our skin starts to make wrinkles, there's no going back. Anyways, the next <clears throat> thing I got is this Studio Makeup Eyeshadow. It's just like, I'm just going to open it and show you the stick, but I'm not going to swatch it. I mean, it's this color. I don't know how I feel about it. This is $25. I'm probably not going to use this. I If you gave me a makeup palette, sure, but I don't know. An eyeshadow palette? That's what I meant. What did I say? Makeup palette. Yeah. Okay, so the next thing I got was an Hourglass Bro Micro Sculpting Pencil. Um, looks like this. Um, obviously, it's just a pencil. Um, I don't want to really like mess with it, but... Um, it's $28. I don't think I'll use this. I mean, I do mess with my eyebrows, but I don't really use a pencil. And I don't want to do it and then not like it and then it's a waste. So, I don't know. I'll consider it. Okay, so the next thing I got is this Ace Beauty, I'm assuming, or Beaut. I'm not sure. But this is a bronze in Paradise palette. It retails for $30. So, you can kind of see the different shades. I don't know how I feel about this, so I'm not going to swatch it. We like shimmer. Yeah, but, I mean, I could probably use it, but do you, do this you retails for $30. I don't do you contour your face or no? Yeah. Sometimes. So the next thing I got was Pure Cosmetics Eye Festival 2.0 Eyeshadow Palette. It um, retails at $36. Comes in a box like this. It looks like this. The only thing that I was annoyed about is, so I'm going to show it to you, but I can't really show it like full on because when I got it, it was broken. This one over here is broken. I mean, the colors are really pretty. Um, and I think I'm probably, obviously I'm going to keep it right because oh, it's yeah, broken, it so but the colors are pretty. Um, so can I'll I swatch it? it since yeah. you've already swatched it? Yeah. That is so pretty, Jess. I want, like, the black, but you can't because it's broken. So I'm going to have to, like, put I it together. I this one, too. Look at that. 
I love their like formula. I kind of want to try this one. Okay, you can just swatch all of them. Wow. Swatch this one. It's pretty. Oh, it's pretty. pretty. I didn't really do the pinky. Anyway, so that was a good palette, I guess. Yeah. Except for the broken yeah. part. How much was that? Thirty-six dollars. Nice. Okay, so the next thing I got was an eyeliner. <laughs> you always get eyeliner. I always get them. I don't use them. What color is that though? Black. Um, this is twenty-one dollars. It's from Dodge Dodge Store. I don't know. But it's just a just plain, plain, nice black eyeliner. I need to. I mean, I have them because I wanted to try to do a wing, but she never does it. The next thing I got was, it was the cream shop. It says Ready Set Glow Cushion Highlighter. It comes in a box like this. Um, and then the little, looks like this. Um, I don't, I mean I use highlighter, but this I wasn't like too impressed with, I guess. It has the little, I don't know if it goes on your whole face. The cushion highlighter is a hydrating formula that gives a, gives a beautiful and something glow. Anyways, I don't know if it goes on your whole face. But anyways, and then you open it and it's in here. Um, it's kind of covered, but... Let's leave it. So that way you, you can see it like... Like that, very. It's like very white. I don't know. I'm not going to touch it or mess with it. But it retails at $20, so... Okay, so the last thing I got was this Grace and Stella um, Eye... Anti-wrinkle energizing eye mask. There's 12 pairs. So this retails at $21, which is not very bad. Like if you think about it, there's 12 pairs. So I probably keep this because I have the bags. I mean they're not Oh it goes right here, right? Like yeah, in this. they're not as bad as like when I work work. Because <laughs> then I get no sleep. But that was my box. What's your last item? The last thing I got was a liquid lipstick. Um looks like this. Let me show you the front of the box, sorry. That's the front of the box. And this is the color, I'll swatch this because I'm gonna keep it. Um, this is like my kind of color. Swatch on me. Hi. Where, over here? Yeah. Oh, that's pretty. It's like a pinkish, but like a brownish. I don't know, it's pretty. Um, and I'm gonna keep this. How much is that? I like it. $17, and I wouldn't spend $17 on a lipstick, so that's how I'm going to keep it. Okay, so whose box do we like more? I mean, this isn't my favorite box. I've I've only had three. I've only gone three, but this, I've had a better box. I think. Yeah. But, um, I really don't like my box, like, like at all. This, I don't want... The pencil, I wouldn't want either. Yeah, the palette, I just knew. I mean, the mask, I could use, but I could have rather prefer something. I mean, I have some, and I don't even use them. <laughs> and then this is $135, but I have a serum right now that I really like, so I don't know if I want to use this. So kind of like, I don't like anything in my box. So I don't really care for my brow pencil, and I don't care for this Ready, Set, Glow, because I just don't like the color of the highlight. Um, I could have done without the palette just because I have a lot of palettes and these colors are pretty but that was I'm your very best thing, that was my best thing but I don't really need it but I mean I'll take it and then it's just annoying that it's broken um, the little this serum I mean I don't what is it for for skin oh, it's a booster. It's yeah a um I won't ever buy skin stuff, so I mean, if they send it, I might keep it and I might use it, which is will benefit me. And then um, the lipstick, of course, I'm gonna keep. So I guess like three out of the five, I guess. So my odds were probably a little better than Stephanie's, but it was okay. Like I would have picked your box over my box only yeah. because the serum, like it's brighter. I I wouldn't have preferred it over this. I mean, it smells good, so. Uh, the lipstick was a pretty shade, and the palette I would have used. So, so I, I would have preferred hers. Tell us what you think, whose box is maybe you Mine was like, more expensive. Yeah, her, and hers was way more expensive. 
um, what you think, what you like, what you don't like. Um, we're just going to wait to see what our next one has. And then wait till September also because I did the Lux. So hopefully I get that also. It's Lux, right? Mm -hmm. So we'll see. I think it's Lux or Lux. I don't know. Something like that. But anyways, that was our boxy, boxy. charm. It's funny Whoa. you say boxy, but I say boxy too, but is it isn't it boxy? It's boxy charm. Oh, but just boxy. And I like we Oh they're boxy. But anyways, thanks for watching guys. Till next time. Have Bye. a great day! Today I am going to compare my Ipsy Plus to my Boxy Premium. So I'm just going to kind of show you what I got and see. So we already did our Boxy Charmy and Jessica, like the regular base box. And I didn't really like my box. So we're going to kind of see. We're going to start off with Ipsy and see what they sent us. I don't have in front of me like what the prices are so okay so first things first is we get the little bag it's called wonderlust I mean it's cute I just don't use these um, I got this billion dollar brows um, I don't do anything to my brows um, like, I don't know if they look shaped, like, obviously, look, there's, like, empty spots. <laughs> because I guess hairs don't grow there. But anyways, I don't do anything. I won't use this. So there's that. Next, we have this Salmon Jean Eye Cream. It's anti-wrinkle. I mean... This I'll probably keep anything with eye cream, eye whatever I keep because like that's one of, besides these wrinkles, my bags, like I need to get fillers. But so this I'll probably keep, I'm not like super thrilled, but whatever. Okay, next we got this IL Mel Make, I don't know how to pronounce it. I want to try their foundation, supposedly it's like good. It's very heavy for this little box. So, I don't know if you can see the color. It's like a dark brown, but it's really heavy. So, I don't know how big it is. So, there's that. I mean, I just don't want one color. And brown, I don't really like brown. So, next we got this Tarte C Mascara. Black. Supposedly, you see the difference in your eyelashes. I like mascaras. I usually keep them. I'm not like particularly picky with them. So, I usually just take whatever. I mean, I like Maybelline. This feels super light. Like there's nothing in there. I'm going to keep it so I'll just show you the wand. It's nice. I mean, I like it. It's okay. I'm gonna edit your ass out. Why? I'm just kidding. Okay, so next thing I got is this probiotic skincare from Tula. I guess it has like SPF. Um, I don't know how I feel about this. I need SPF stuff, but it has like pineapple and papaya. It protects and it glows. So I wonder if it has like a. Ooh, I'll probably keep it. It's just clear but it has like a shimmer it has like a it looks glossy but it's shimmery too like you see the shine it's not that it's wet it's, it gives you a shine so I'll probably keep this so those were my five items for my Ipsy Jessica's breaking out in the back just so you guys can tell like <laughs> she does it's not just me doing the workouts um, okay, so out of the five items, I didn't really care for these, and I I was okay with these three. So it was an okay box. I didn't really get anything makeup. Well, the two makeup things I got, I didn't like. So, not bad. Let's check out my Boxy Premium. So I did get a card. I got Variation 50. So the first thing 
I got is this really, well, it's not really big, but it's bigger than the Ipsy bags. So this I probably can use. Like, you see the difference? Something will fit in here. Nothing fits in here. Um, so this I'll probably keep or give it in a giveaway. I don't really know. It's just really cute. I kind of like it. Anyway, so I got this bag. Supposedly this bag retails for $20. I would not spend $20 on this. Okay, I can't fit it in there. Okay, so the next thing I got is this Pericone MD No Makeup Lipstick. This retails for $30. My box came kind of damaged. And it's basically um, this lipstick. Oh, um, it looks kind of like gross. Um, I, I don't know. This has like SPF of 15. Not a big fan. Next thing I got was this Kenya um, on Tiveros. On Tiveros. I don't know if she's Hispanic or has a Hispanic last name. I want to pronounce it on Tiveros or on. Ah! You're scaring people. It hurts. Um, this it's a really nice packaging, but it is. Uh, blush. Is this blush? This is blush and highlight powder. So look at it. That's really pretty. I will keep this because I like these colors. This retails for $42. So I like my box so far. Okay, next thing I got is this Biro. I'm assuming Biro. I don't know. I wish they would have how to pronounce this. This is $95. And this is a toner. So right now, I don't really use toners. Like, I'll do a cleanser and then I put, like, mo like the moisturizers and serums. But I don't do this step. So I'm going to keep this because instead of buying a toner, I mean, it's $95. This better make me look, like, $25. Okay, then... Another thing I got is this Ciate Everyday Vacay. So last time I tried their, I think I got like setting powder. This is a setting spray and I love setting sprays. So I think I'm going to keep this baby. This little bottle looks so cute. Mm, smells like coconut. So this... Yummy, we love coconut. I know, I love the way it smells. Like, it makes me want to have a raspa. <laughs> What's a raspa? A snow cone. Um, this retails for $22, so I'm keeping this. And then the last thing I got was this Morphe with Manny makeup artist. So this is his palette. I'm going to keep this too. This palette has 12 wearable anything but basic eyeshadows and matte and shimmer finishes with two stunning highlighters. So this retails for $20. I mean, I love this color. I live for the pinks. This one looks pretty too. This one too. So out of this box, I loved this. I'm going to use the cleanser. The blush and highlight palette, the setting spray, the only, even the bag I liked. The only thing I didn't care for was the light lipstick thing. But this box is one of my better um, boxy premiums. I wonder if you guys got a better box. Let me know in the comments below if you loved your box better than mine. <laughs> So I can be jealous. Um, and if you recorded your channel, then go ahead and let me know on the bottom that to go check out your channel so I can go see what you got. Okay, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see y'all later. Bye.